um, well, you know, UNICEF is present in 190 countries and territories. And uh, the modus operandi of UNICEF is always through partners. Of course, first of all, the country, governments, and, uh, but implementing partners, agencies, academic institutions, etc. Second point that I want, the, in UNICEF, we don't really make a very strong separation between our emergency work and our programmatic work. So we tend to stay for extended periods in countries where we do program work. And I think this is relevant for this presentation because we we want to focus on the not just responding and preparing and responding to outbreaks, but actually the work that happens in between outbreaks when the hotspots are out of the spotlight. In the last two years, UNICEF, we have been working in developing what we call the Public Health Emergencies Team, which basically, which I lead, and basically uh, the objective is to bring all the different streams of work that we had in preparedness, response, and programmatic work for, uh, ep for epidemics, for public health emergencies, into a single program. So where you may have heard we have capacity for WASH and for risk communication and for health and for immunization, and those things are now being brought under a single coordination mechanism. So those introductory points are quite relevant to our